All right, guys, here we are, Rob Bush Motorsports, 190hookup.com. We're going to tell some stories. We're going to see some parts. Let's check out this awesome shop that I know so many of you patronize. And there is the man himself, Mr. Rob Bush. How the heck are you doing, doing Rob? Doing great, Jack. How about you? Man, I'm doing wonderful. It's great to finally get down here. I've been seeing you at the races for probably 30 years. Um, you know, we got some memories up here on the walls. You uh, doing a great job as a competitor. You're now on the industry side of this thing. How are things going for you? Bring me up to speed with Rob Bush. Man, we have been very, very busy. We are truly blessed. Um, we got a lot of great customers. Uh, I can't say enough about our customers. We, you know, we help tons of different engine builders and stuff out there and they keep us busy. Um, a lot of other shops, a lot of these other guys you see in there on Facebook and stuff, you know, tagged in parts and stuff. We end up shipping a lot of those parts for a lot of those guys. You know, we do a lot of drop ships for a lot of our dealers and we want to thank them too. Well, let's take a look at what you got. But before we go any further, look what I found. We got some motorcycles in here, Rob. We've got something crazy going on around here. Um, this is it. this is one of our personal bikes. We use this thing more for R and D, um, trying out new products for you know developers and stuff like that. We change it around probably a couple of times a year. Engines go in and out and in and out, and you're trying something new all the time. And we have some familiar faces over here. I see some hardworking employees. Who do we have? Mike. Good to see you. Hi. And? I'm Ruth. It's always nice to see you guys at the races. You have one heck of a team here. Yeah, Ruthie's the one who answers the phone, you know, and okay. takes care of all our orders and second stuff one. like that, you the know? second one. Second one that answers the phone. <laughs> so, so you are customer service and that's what, you have the per perfect personality for it since you're so polite and sweet and. I try. I try to do my best. You, just like a good baseball manager, you put the right people in the right spots, don't you? Yeah, well, the, the good thing about Ruth and, and the way that we run our stuff is we're all racers. You call a lot of these other shops for parts and stuff like that, you're going to get somebody trying to tell you something. We can, we can lead you in the right direction. Ruthie races these bikes. She uses these parts that we sell. Um, and so we get a lot of calls, you know, about advice and, you know, we can give them advice and lead them in the, in the right direction. That way they're not throwing good money after bad. Um, sometimes a customer calls, they want something that's not necessarily what they need. They, they're calling to order it because their buddy ordered it. Well, if they're going in a different direction, it might not be what they need. So we tried to lead them in the right direction um, and give them the best advice that we can. We've been doing this 30 years. Ruthie's, I've been racing for over 30 years. Ruth's been racing for the last 15 or 20 years. Yeah. Um, been Mike's been racing the last years. the last 15 or so years. So Fish is here with us, you know, hell between us all, we probably got a damn hundred years experience That's just awesome. in the damn Hayabusa stuff alone. And all different and all different varieties of racing and all different categories. You know, we've got grudge, we've got match racing. We used to do the super street bike series and you know, we've we've all done the man cup and we've all index raced, bracket raced. It's just, it's been fun. How cool is it to work around something you're passionate about? We're surrounded by motorcycles and motorcycle parts and you guys are racers, like Rob said. It's, it's definitely fun. It definitely keeps you on your toes and you, you learn about everything new. You learn about, I love to sit in here and listen to Rob talk about years back, back in the day when, you know, things were being developed. I absolutely love listening to that because it's, it's cool to me. I love the nostalgia. It's learning. Absolutely. You're yeah. always learning. You got a great team. Well, I know you got one heck of a parts inventory, so let's go check it out. All right, guys, it is the 190 hookup for good reason because they hook so many of you racers up with a ton of parts. Let's take a look at some of this giant inventory. The shelves are stocked, and I can tell you right now, Rob, in COVID era, that's a beautiful thing because I hear from everybody, it's so hard to get parts right now, but you got a great inventory. Yeah, we got to, right now, you got to stay two, three, four months ahead, you know, on ordering some of this stuff. Some of our vendors are getting a little behind, um, but we're trying to stay ahead. That way we've got what the racers need when they need it. Okay, so what are we looking at here? Looks like Hayabusa Paradise to me. Man, we've got a variety of things. Uh, fuel cells for the Hayabusa, Jixer 1000, hardcore fuel cells. Um, 
MTC sliders and Gen 2s for all your Hayabusa, Jixer 1000, ZX14, um, like the Ryan Schnitz RSR oh, modules, yeah. you know, Shout those things are Schnitz. super popular. Energy coils, energy, you know, energy coil igniters, anything you could use for from Max, you know, as far as the Max race and the premiums. Um, well, I got to stop you right here because we're mentioning some big companies. Eric Hostetler from MTC, Ryan Schnitz, Steve Nichols from Max ECU. So clearly... You, from going to the racetrack for 30 years and being a big name, you have quite a Rolodex of friends that help you out here, don't you? Oh, yeah. We've been doing this a long time. And we couldn't do it, you know, without without these great vendors also, you know, who design and develop these products. That's cool. Whole selection of sprockets down here. Man, we got all kind of goodies. What's the hottest product right now? Oh, it's... What'd you say our hottest product do right now is? Oof. Eight. Probably our rod and main bearing kits. Really? You okay. know, we service uh, we that we service a lot of other dealers and a lot of other engine builders. Okay. Um, and like our rod and main bearing kits for the Hayabusa's, the Jixer One Thousands, the ZX Fourteen, ZX Tens. Um, those are some of our best movers. We sell probably five or six Hayabusa rod and main bearing kits per day. A couple of Jixer One Thousand, ZX Fourteen. Engine builders know that we've got this stuff in stock, so they call us. Awesome. Well, congratulations on that. I hope I'm not calling you for any main bearings, though. That means something went terribly wrong. It was a bad weekend at the racetrack, but we, we've seen a few bad weekends, haven't we? Oh, we, <laughs> we carry a lot of that stuff to the track with us, too. You know, I mean, we've got, actually, we've still got, the trailer is still slap full from this past weekend um, at the All-Harley race, which we were both at in Orangeburg, but there's really no sense in us unloading it because we're back out of here on Thursday to head to the Man Cup, the 190hookup.com Nationals in Rockingham, North Carolina this weekend. That's great. And that brings me to another point is you really give this sport a lot of support, and, and that means a lot. Um, you know, does it give you a warm, fuzzy feeling to be able to give back to the racers like that? Because uh, you sponsor so it, much. Well, it's great. I've been blessed, you know, when I had a lot of help early on starting out um, from Bill Robinson, Dave Schnitz, um, John Noonan back when he was at J.E. Pistons, um, Bob Carpenter, uh, Barbara at Megacycle, you know, when when we started running with the Hayabusa stuff and we're the first one in the sixes, then they all kind of wanted to be part of our program and, you know, everybody wanted to help us and see us succeed. Um, and I feel it's only right to give back, you know. You see a racer out there struggling, go talk to them. Go help them, you know. Rob, so much to see here. What else are we looking at? Um, some of these are uh, front racks from JL Design. Um, really, really nice stuff. These guys do great work. Um, it's what we have on Mackenzie Ellis's new bike. She's um, going to be a superstar, huh? Yeah. Shout out to her. Yeah, I'm, I'm super glad to be able to help her and Chip Good out, now. you know. We've been friends a long time. Um, titanium bolt kits. Uh, these are all these are all transmissions. Um, billet six speed autos ready to go. ZX fourteen Pro Street cuts. Gen one, Gen two Pro Street cuts. We kind of try to keep this stuff because guys need it in a hurry. You tear something up on Wednesday night in testing, you're wanting it next day aired and get your stuff back ready for the following weekend. Sure. You know. Um, these are these are carpenter cylinder heads. Oh they're they're fully CNC'd, ready to go. Uh, we keep these things on the shelf, uh, a lot of times completely assembled, ready to go. That way the customer needs it in a hurry. They don't, they don't want to hear two days, two weeks, or two months, you That's know? Right. Um, we're all, we're all racers. We don't, you know, you want it fast, you sure. know? Um, Cometic gaskets. If it's a, if it's a Hayabusa gasket, we probably have it. Um, ZX-14, I mean, these are all, uh, like engine rebuild kits, you know? And we probably, between the two stacks, there's probably 60, 70, 80 of them there, you wow. know? Uh, any Suzuki clutch kits, you know? All the Track King kits AP. that APE does, you know? We sell a lot of those ZX14 Track King kits, you know? And a lot of times cool. it's hard for, for Jay and them to keep up, you know, with the demand, you know? And I got to tell you, when I was out talking to APE, Jay, he gave you a big compliment. He looked at me and said, hey, Rob Bush is moving a lot of product for us, so... Yeah. All yep. the way from California, you got a little pat on the back. How about that? There you go. Um, crankshafts. We keep crankshafts in stock. These are the APE 9mm billets, um, but we keep new Kawasaki and Suzuki crankshafts in stock. Um, 
windscreens, JL subframes, um, seat pans, you know. These are uh, <coughs> these are all from I1 Moto. Um, say what, dude? Catalyst. Catalyst, you know. Seat oh, pans, beautiful. you know, in stock. These things are pretty popular, you know. Guys want them now, you know. Otherwise, if we didn't have it, you're going to wait, you know, basically a month to get one made, you know. Uh, air shifter parts. There's bits of fitting, switching valves. Um, I see some Dan Rudd MPS goodies down here. Yep. We all the all the MP. We even you know even though we make our own air shifter kits, you know, um, one of the popular sellers is still the MPS air shifter kit. You know, that's right. We sell all of their stuff, their own board compressors. Um, we keep a. Uh, we try to keep a complete line. These are all uh, sprockets, uh, or actually gears for transmissions from Robinson Industries. For the new ZX-10s, the new model 2017 and up, uh, Gixxer 1000s. Uh, hardware for all your MTC stuff. Adams Performance, all of their lowering links for, you know, the Gixxer 1000s, ZX-14s. Worldwide you always gotta bearings. have these. Dave Conforti. Gotta you always got to have For these. For sure. Put them in my KZ. That thing was rolling smooth. One of the best in the industry. We no sell doubt. a lot of, you know, Dave, Dave supports the industry a lot, you know, and we try to support him, and we Gosh. sell a lot of his bearings for him. He gets great support. Yes, he does. Um, fuel system stuff. Uh, fuel system and nitrous stuff. Fuel pumps, regulators, solenoids, you know, uh, nitrous manifold clamps they're these are always big sellers uh if, if they make it we try to stock it i love it if a customer a calls and we don't have something that that they want i just don't call and order one of them we order that stuff in multiples that way we have it and i see you keep ruth very busy huh stocking these shelves my goodness and that's it's a daily thing to we pull it off the shelf and restock every day this is like toys r us for a hayabusa guy or zx14 guy i love it man you got some awesome awesome yeah here's a ton of products from ape um all the popular selling stuff for the jixer 1000 the zx14 the hayabusa the new model jixer um we sell a lot of valves um a lot of ape valves a lot of Vance and heinz valves too um Stud nut kits from APE. Any anything that APE sells, we you know, we we try to stock that stuff for the sport bikes. Yeah, we said we said Hayabusa a lot, but let us not forget about the ZX14, ZX10, because you got Team Green parts in here as well. A oh, lot of them. Yeah, we do a lot. I mean, if it fits inside the engine internals for a ZX10 or ZX14, we probably have it on the shelf. Uh, as far as head gaskets, uh ring sets uh, cam chain guides uh these are all clutches for for the zx14 just these right here i mean and these things they're they're stacked deep and they're double stacked back through there there's probably 120 140 clutch plates through there um all the rod and main bearings for your zx14 like i said we sell to a ton of other engine builders you know um but if it's a if it's a rider main bearing for a ZX14, ZX10, we've got them all the ZX10 clutches, um oil filters, cam chains. Everybody knows if you're a ZX14, you're you know how the the ZX14 is notorious for for killing the cam chain. There's probably 8 or 9 new cam chains in this box because like I say we sell to a lot of other engine builders and they they want this stuff now. Same thing with Suzuki. Um, if it fits inside that engine, we've probably got it. There's from every bearing, ring set, guides, shifter covers, oil pumps, gaskets, um, you name it, we've got it. Clutches, fork seals, individual plates, water pumps, coolant reservoirs, because they like to break and leak after a while. Yeah, this right here, this is nothing but bearings for the Hayabusa and Gixxer 1000. Wow. 
Um, every bearing. We even make up kits like this because there's a lot of engine builders who want to use all green rod and main bearings. So we build, we've got little kits already made up, ready to go. Um, we've actually got so many of some that we got to hang them from the shelves, How you know, from that? the ceilings. And... and we got some components from Brock's Performance Products. You know, you got to have some Brock stuff in here. Oh yeah. We sell a lot of clutch springs, um, his clutch cushion kits, the clutch mods. Um, these things are super popular. Uh, you buy a new model sport bike, you've oh, got yeah. to you've got to have this type of stuff if you're if you're going to drag race. Mm -hmm. I've got one in mind. You you got know to. it. Um, there's his lower end link kits. You know, oil line. You, you know, removal kits. Uh, oil filter relocates from Johnny at Exotic Cycle. Those those are big movers right there. Um billet oil filters we, have we usually keep a bunch of dme too. oil pans but those things go about as quick as you can get them in um quick access covers for the hayabusa and zx14 billet oil pans uh we've got wegos over here and launch masters and nc2s and a random power commander that we have in stock we usually don't stock electrical stuff because we don't want it to sit got you um, and go back to these flow filters. We have them for Kawasaki, Suzuki, and we carry those for Harley now. Yeah, we We're just started. We're starting to venture yep. into the Harley parts. We've got some lowering links. We've got some oil filters. We've got some plugs. We're, we're getting there. It's a learning curve. And speaking of your good buddy, Chip Ellis, that's not a tater gun up there, is it? Yeah, there's not a couple of them up there. Uh, not one, but two. Two tater two guns. Two of them. Yep. Chip, you know, he was on about a two-week turnaround time, but he is so covered up with work now that we started putting these things on the shelves. That way, you know, guys have a little less wait time. Well, we've I'm got them for the big tube for Carpenter's big head. Um, we've got them for nitrous applications, for normally aspirated applications. Yeah, I mean, and they're the most powerful pipes on the planet. You look at every grudge bike out there now, uh, all the front runners are running the tater gun. Well, that and it helps because you know with some of the bigger bikes you need different things and they're, they're tailor-made to your application that's the coolest thing about them let's take a look at some piston kits Ooh, i like piston kits do we have some cp carrillo goodies back here oh yes, yeah do. um and some Vance and Hines goodies Vance and Hines valves and as, as eddie and those guys will tell you they're their suppliers been behind um where normally these shelves are full with vance and heinz valves but we're having a little supply issue right now getting those uh but carpenter valve springs so uh, we keep them for everything mega cycle cams we've got cams already done 395s 427s you name it and if somebody needs something custom done i can get them a cam turned around in two weeks you know very cool uh blocks they're one of our big sellers the block and piston kits these are all these are all Hayabusa blocks already done. 83, 84, 85 millimeter. They're they're ready to go. Um, like I say, the customer doesn't want to wait a month to get their block replated, or you know, or overboard or something like that. So we've got them on the shelf. We do, and you know, um, we do like a kit that includes piston kit, head gasket, and cylinder exchange. And those are super super popular. Very cool. Goodies. There's some CP goodies. Yeah, we keep there. a ton of the of the JE brand. Um, if you want to see one of their new pistons, these are we're actually the first ones in the country to have these. Oh wow! Uh, we had worked with JE on designing them. It's their new Ultra Series. Okay. They're a really really nice part. Uh, let's take a look at one. These are actually a shelf wow. part now, instead of having to wait and order a custom piston. Okay. Uh, these are for the Hayabusa, but they've got a anti-friction around the skirt. Mm -hmm. They've got a thermal barrier on the top for high performance for nitrous or turbo application. And they're gas ported, which is a great feature for any piston. Sure. Yeah, we work with the guys, we work with Billy Ramsey and the guys over at JE. Um, and yeah, like I said, we got the first ones in the country and 
these things, as soon as we started announcing it, they're flying off the shelf. A lot of the other engine builders, Carlo, Testa, and those guys, we've got some, we've got a, a big box of stuff going out to them for him and Joey. Uh, they're building a new 460 bike for next year that's going to run these. Uh, crankshaft to set up our rods and stuff like that. One of our billet blocks. But yeah, these are a really, really nice part. Um, Wozner blocks for guys who don't have their who don't have their own core, um, or for guys who have a Gen 2 Hayabusa, which everybody knows the Gen 2 block is prone to failure when you overbore it. So the the Wozner block gives the guys a uh, you know an alternative to where if you can't find a core, you buy those outright. These other ones that we have over here, they they're for exchange. Um, these along in here, these are all our own billet blocks. We do those things in-house um, and then they're plated by Millennium. Um, Ruthie's got one behind you that- Whoa, that Ruthie, is, what Just in case you you've have. never seen these before, these bad boys are beautiful. This one's actually, we're setting it up for sleeves. Wow. Somebody's gonna have a whole lot of pressure in there. Oh my gosh. But they wanna be pretty while they're doing it. Absolutely beautiful. I love them. That's amazing. What else we got here, Rob? Uh, rods, Wozner rods, Corella rods. Uh, one of our one of our really really popular sellers is our own. We make our own aluminum rods uh, for the Gen One and Gen Two Hayabusa. A lot of grudge guys use these things. Uh, really really nice parts. We've we've never had a failure with these things. A lot of people are scared of aluminum rods, uh, but super super light. Um, normally aspirated or nitrous applications we have them we've even got some broad designs for like the the turbo bikes which have a you know a, they're a little thicker a little beefier uh the the ones for the turbo they're capable of handling 2000 plus horsepower wow. so but yeah corella rods and those things are pretty hard to get and we sell you know we sell a lot of those but you got to order two to three months ahead of time if you if you want to keep your inventory up but yeah a lot of a lot of wasner and corella rods uh these are some of our own custom pistons that we had uh cp design they're a 78 millimeter nitrous piston for the 2017 and up gixxer 1000 wow. uh we do a lot of custom pistons i've got sheets in there for so many other engine builders and grudge teams you know like Tony and those guys at eight below, um, they're always coming up with new stuff. Everybody in the grudge world knows them, you know. Um, Justin Lang and those guys, we do a ton of stuff for them. We're always glad to help, you know. And we'll, we help anybody out there. It doesn't matter. Um, we help any engine builder out there and all of their stuff is proprietary to them, you know. Mm -hmm. um, we, don't, we don't let other people get anybody else's part numbers when we create something for them. It's specifically for them, and we will not sell that product to anyone else. And you guys even do work, don't you? Not just parts, labor. Oh yeah, we do a lot of machine work for a lot of people. Uh, this head here came from a customer. He'll end up getting a full CNC with O-ring, chamber flush. And of course we use Carpenter only, exclusively for all our CNC stuff. Bob's the best in the business. He's been yes. helping me for 30 years. Uh, he taught me a lot of what I know about these Hayabusa engines. This one here is from a car customer who's got a Hayabusa turbocharged engine in a, in a car that he does rally stuff with. Uh, we'll be CNCing the head for him, setting it up with stainless steel intake and exhaust valves, uh, setting it up to his cams, send him back a package that's ready to bolt on for the do-it-yourselfer. And you go to the races so much, a lot of guys to save on shipping, they'll say, hey, can you bring it to the races? And that's awesome. Oh yeah, um, this is a ZX-10 case that's uh, been bored and plated by Millennium that we'll deliver back to a customer. This stuff here, there's some shocks from Marcus at M2. Uh, both of these shocks will be going with us to the Man Cup race for some guy from our good customers over in Aruba. Shout out Marcus McBain. Yep, here's a set of forks we're fixing to ship out to Marcus. Um, Right here, some couple of cranks that Mikey just boxed up on Friday before we got out of here that have to go to Marine to get repaired. Um, we got a box sitting here for one of our good customers, Aleko Polis, over in Greece. Uh, You're worldwide, Rob Bush. That he's getting, you know. 
This guy's getting piston oh, kits, like uh, blocks, morning. you know, Wozner blocks, injectors already done, uh, Brock products. Uh, we're waiting on a couple of more things to come in to fill his order, and this box will be headed to Greece. Now, Ruthie, I heard you just say something about a secret product that's not even listed. What is it called? We call it our 190hookup.com pimp juice. Pimp juice? Yeah. What, what is the pimp juice, guys? It's traction compound. Traction compound? For, I gotta imagine, street racers? Yeah. Um, Allegedly. Allegedly. In Allegedly. Mexico, right? Yes. Yeah. In Mexico. Yeah, they do, yep. that. they do that out of the United States where it's completely legal. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, we're, we get a lot of local people. You know, um, all the way around. Call up. We don't even have this stuff listed on the website because we're really not supposed to be shipping it around the world without a bunch of hazardous stuff on there. We don't ship it. Um, yeah, we, we don't ship this, but if you call us, call and talk to us, we might can assist you in Local getting... Local pickup. There we go. Trackside pickup. <laughs> Good stuff. Remember when Chip said that shit? Well, has this been awesome or what? Rob, thank you so much. I appreciate your Anytime, lovely assistance over you. here. Guys, this has been awesome. Uh, Rob, anything you'd like to add here before we go? Uh, not, remember the 190hookup.com nationals coming up this coming weekend at Rockingham, North Carolina. Man Cup race. Uh, awesome. He sports a lot of races. Wide variety of classes. Everybody be sure to check us out at the finals. Um, if any of our overseas customers need parts to pick up at the Man Cup Finals this year, get your orders in now, because some of these vendors are pretty far behind, so we're already taking orders for pickup there. Um, and don't forget about hoodies, sweatshirts, stuff like that. Winter's coming up. We got plenty of that type stuff on our website. And if by chance somebody sees this video on Cycle Drag, they want to call and see if there's any specials or any maybe hidden discounts, maybe we can hook them up a little bit. Yeah, we'll put something together. Yeah, we'll. Uh... How about that, guys? Is he awesome or what? He gives back to the racers. So you got to call. You'll probably end up talking to this fine young lady on the phone. Get your parts. 190 hookup has it all. Guys, make it. sure the phone is kind of hard to get through. Those things ring off the hook all day long, so there's long wait times. So we've got our Rob Bush Motorsports Facebook page, and we have a 190hookup.com Facebook page. Feel free to message that at any time. We do have remote access to those, so when we're at the racetrack, if we've got some time, we'll get back to you guys if you have questions or comments or concerns. Um, you can also email us. There's an option to email us through the website. Hop on 190hookup.com and go in there and hit message us. Awesome, guys. Thanks so much. We appreciate it. Thank you, Jack. It was an awesome tour. We had fun. Guys, make sure you give them a call. 190hookup. Mention Cycle Drag if you like that video. Here's another one for you. Subscribe right in the middle. And you know if there's anything fast motorcycles or motorcycle parts, we're in. Cycle Drag rolls on.